Join our Facebook page and Facebook group. Also join our YouTube channel. Link is given below description box. This is our welding series video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer that tasked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. Define welding and its types. Answer. Welding is the process of joining similar or different metal by heating. Welding is used in the fabrication of automobile bodies, aircraft, machine frames, boilers, shipbuilding, railway wagons, etc. Basically welding are two types, which are Pressure welding Fusion welding or non-pressure welding Question number 2. What types of equipment needed for arc welding? Answer. The common equipment needed for arc welding are Welding generator DC electrode holder electrode cables earthing clamps protective shield or transformer AC gloves apron chipping hammer wire brush. Question number 3. What are the types of consumable electrodes? Answer. There are three types of consumable electrodes which are bare electrodes. They are not coated with flux lightly coated electrodes. A light layer of flux is coated on the electrodes heavily coated electrodes. Flux is coated on the electrodes to a thickness of 1 mm to 3 mm. Question number 4. What are the types of welded joints? Answer. The types of welded joints are, butt joint lap joint T joint corner joint flange joint. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. List out the various defects in welding. Answer. The various welding defects are. 1. Incomplete fusion 2. Slag inclusion 3. Crack 4. Undercut 5. Porosity and blue holes. Question number 6. What is gas welding? Name the gases used in gas welding. Answer. Gas welding is a process of joining metals by the heat of the flame formed when oxygen burns with another gas. The following gases are used to produce flame in gas welding oxygen, acetylene oxygen, hydrogen air acetylene. Question number 7. What equipment need for gas welding? Answer. The equipment needs for gas welding are gas cylinders pressure regulators pressure gauges hoses welding torch question number eight what are the three types of flames in gas welding answer the three types of flames in gas welding are neutral flame carburizing flame oxidizing flame question number nine what is bronze welding give its applications Answer. Bronze welding is an intermediate process between brazing and welding. Bronze welding can be done in cast iron, steel, copper, bronze and brass. Question number 10. Differentiate between soldering and brazing. Answer. Soldering is the process of joining two similar or dissimilar metals by using a low melting alloy called solder. Solder is an alloy of tin and lead. Brazing is the process of joining two similar or dissimilar metals by using a high melting alloy called spelter. Spelter is a mixture of copper and please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Join our Facebook page and Facebook group.
Also join our YouTube channel. Link this is our welding series box. video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer that asked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. What is the meaning of slag when welding? Answer. It is the combo of carbonate and silicate material, when the heat produces and reaches to the weld zone then slag formed in flux and produce gases that push it back, preventing purpose. Question number 2. What is the difference between SMAW and MIG? Answer. SMAW means shielded metal arc welding and MIG means metal inert gas welding. In small flux cord electrode is used for welding and when arc generates, gas is generated by burning of flux protects arc of the welding end. In MIG inert gas is flowed around the arc generated by bare electrode of same as metal being welded. Inert gases are like argon and helium is used for shielding. Question number 3. What is difference between TIG and MIG? Answer. While metal inert gas, MIG, and tungsten inert gas, TIG, are both shielded arc welding applications, they are very different from one another. MIG wells are created with a consumable electrode, while TIG wells are created with a non-consumable electrode. TIG welding typically includes filler metal as well. TIG and MIG arc welding can both be automated. However, TIG is a more complicated process so the equipment question number 4, what is fusion welding? Answer. In case of fusion welding the metal to be welded, is heated up to molten state and ray solidification results in completion of the weld. Examples, arc welding, gas welding, TIG welding, MIG welding etc. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. What is GTA welding? Answer. GTA is an abbreviation of gas tungsten arc welding. It is a type of arc welding in which the non-consumable tungsten electrode is used. The gas is used for shielding welding from atmosphere. The gas mostly used for this purpose is either argon or helium which are chemically inert. There is no need for filler metal for welding thin materials but additional filler material used for welding thick plates. Question number 6. List out the applications and advantages of friction welding. Answer. Applications. Friction welding is used for welding aero engine parts and gas turbine shafts. It is also used for welding pinions to shafts, rods to yokes, flanges to pipes, etc. Advantages. The initial cost is low. Dissimilar metals can be welded. It is a simple and fast process. High quality weld can be obtained. The question number 7, what is thermit? Give the applications of thermit welding? Answer. Thermit steel is a mixture of aluminium powder and iron oxide in the ration of 1 to 3. Thermit welding is used for joining heavy parts, rails, pipes, shafts, cables and worn out machine frames. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Question number 8. What is seam welding? List out its applications. Answer. Seam welding is a process of making weld continuously between two overlapping sheet metals. Seam welding is used for welding radiators, drums, leak-proof tanks, automobile silencers, etc. This is a demo. Question number 9. What is spot welding? Give its applications? Answer. Spot welding is a type of resistance welding which is used for joining overlapping sheet metals by making weld at regular interval. Boxes, cans, automobile frames and air condition. Question number 10. What is the difference between upset butt welding and flash butt welding? Answer. In upset butt welding, 
The metals to be welded are clamped in copper jaws so that there is a light contact at the ends of metals. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Join our Facebook page and Facebook group. Also join our YouTube channel. This video below description box. This video shows interview questions for welding, QA slash QC and mechanical students. From this video a mechanical student and QC inspector can learn about basic welding Viva question and answer that asked in top company Viva. After see this video mechanical engineer can gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. This is our welding series video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer the tasked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. Define welding and its types. Answer. Welding is the process of joining similar or different metal by heating. Welding is used in the fabrication of automobile bodies, aircraft, machine frames, boilers, shipbuilding, railway wagons, etc. Basically welding are two types, which are Pressure welding Fusion welding or non-pressure welding Question number 2. What types of equipment needed for arc welding? Answer. The common equipment needed for arc welding are Welding generator DC electrode holder electrode cables earthing clamps protective shield or transformer AC gloves apron chipping hammer wire brush. Question number 3. What are the types of consumable electrodes? Answer. There are three types of consumable electrodes which are bare electrodes. They are not coated with flux lightly coated electrodes. A light layer of flux is coated on the electrodes heavily coated electrodes. Flux is coated on the electrodes to a thickness of 1 mm to 3 mm. Question number 4. What are the types of welded joints? Answer. The types of welded joints are, butt joint lap joint T-joint corner joint flange joint. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. List out the various defects in welding. Answer. The various welding defects are. 1. Incomplete fusion 2. Slag inclusion 3. Crack 4. Undercut 5. Porosity and blow holes. Question number 6. What is gas welding? Name the gases used in gas welding. Answer. Gas welding is a process of joining metals by the heat of the flame formed when oxygen burns with another gas. The following gases are used to produce flame in gas welding oxygen, acetylene oxygen, hydrogen air acetylene. Question number 7. What equipment need for gas welding? Answer. The equipment needs for gas welding are. Gas cylinders, pressure regulators, pressure gauges, hoses, welding torch. Question number 8. What are the three types of flames in gas welding? Answer. The three types of flames in gas welding are. Neutral flame, carburizing flame, oxidizing flame. Question number 9. 
What is bronze welding? Give its applications. Answer. Bronze welding is an intermediate process between brazing and welding. Bronze welding can be done in cast iron, steel, copper, bronze and brass. Question number 10. Differentiate between soldering and brazing. Answer. Soldering is the process of joining two similar or dissimilar metals by using a low melting alloy called solder. Solder is an alloy of tin and lead. Brazing is the process of joining two similar or dissimilar metals by using a high melting alloy called spelter. Spelter is a mixture of copper and please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. This is our welding series video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer that asked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. What is the meaning of slag when welding? Answer. It is the combo of carbonate and silicate material, when the heat produces and reaches to the weld zone then slag formed in flux and produce gases that push it back, preventing purpose. Question number 2. What is the difference between SMAO and MIG? Answer. SMAO means shielded metal arc welding and MIG means metal inert gas welding. In SMAO flux cord electrode is used for welding and when arc generates, gas is generated by burning of flux protects arc of the welding end. In MIG inert gas is flowed around the arc generated by bare electrode of same as metal being welded. Inert gases are like argon and helium is used for shielding. Question number 3. What is difference between TIG and MIG? Answer. While metal inert gas, MIG, and tungsten inert gas, TIG, are both shielded arc welding applications, they are very different from one another. MIG welds are created with a consumable electrode, while TIG welds are created with a non-consumable electrode. TIG welding typically includes filler metal as well. TIG and MIG arc welding can both be automated. However, TIG is a more complicated process so the equipment question number 4, what is fusion welding? Answer. In case of fusion welding the metal to be welded, is heated up to molten state and ray solidification results in completion of the weld. Examples, arc welding, gas welding, TIG welding, MIG welding etc. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. What is Gta welding? Answer. Gta is an abbreviation of gas tungsten arc welding. It is a type of arc welding in which the non-consumable tungsten electrode is used. The gas is used for shielding welding from atmosphere. The gas mostly used for this purpose is either argon or helium which are chemically inert. There is no need for filler metal for welding thin materials but additional filler material used for welding thick plates. Question number 6. List out the applications and advantages of friction welding. Answer. Applications. Friction welding is used for welding aero engine parts and gas turbine shafts. It is also used for welding pinions to shafts, rods to yokes, flanges to pipes, etc. Advantages The initial cost is low. Dissimilar metals can be welded. It is a simple and fast process. High quality weld can be obtained. The question number 7, what is thermit? Give the applications of thermit welding? Answer. Thermit steel is a mixture of aluminium powder and iron oxide in the ration of 1 to 3. Thermit welding is used for joining heavy parts, rails, pipes, shafts, cables and worn-out machine frames.
Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Question number 8. What is seam welding? List out its applications. Answer. Seam welding is a process of making weld continuously between two overlapping sheet metals. Seam welding is used for welding radiators, drums, leak-proof tanks, automobile silencers, etc. This is a demo. Question number 9. What is spot welding? Give its applications. Answer. Spot welding is a type of resistance welding which is used for joining overlapping sheet metals by making weld at regular interval. Boxes, cans, automobile frames and air condition. Question number 10. What is the difference between upset butt welding and flash butt welding? Answer. In upset butt welding, the metals to be welded are clamped in copper jaws so that there is a light contact at the ends of metals. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. This is our welding series video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer that asked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. What is neutral flame? Give its application. Answer. The neutral flame is produced when equal quantities of oxygen and acetylene gases are used. Neutral flame is used for welding steel, cast iron, aluminum, copper and stainless steel. Question number 2. When carburizing flame is produced? State its applications. Answer. Carburizing flame is produced when the quantity of acetylene is more than oxygen. Carburizing flame is used for welding steel, alloy steels, non-ferrous metals, nickel and monial metal. Question number 3. How oxidizing flame is produced? List out its applications. Answer. Oxidizing flame is produced when the quantity of oxygen is more than acetylene. Oxidizing flame is used for welding brass, bronze, manganese and steel. Question number 4. What is hard facing? List out its applications. Answer. Hard facing is a process of coating a hard metal powder on the surface of soft metals. Application, it is used for coating tungsten carbide and chromium carbide on the surface of cutting tool. It is used in reconditioning of worn out machine parts by coating required metal on it. It is used for coating hard metal in the die surface. Question number 5. What is laser? List out the advantages of laser beam welding. Answer. Laser means light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. It is a beam of light having a single wavelength. Advantages. The temperature can be controlled easily welding can be accurately done no distortion occurs heat treated components can be welded without affecting its properties the weld is not affected by oxidation. Question number 6. What are types of brazing? Answer. The various types of brazing are, torch brazing, dip brazing, induction brazing, furnace. Question number 7. What are the advantages and disadvantages of explosive welding? Answer. The advantages and disadvantages of explosive welding are, advantages. It is a simple and fast process. The welding strength is high. Large surfaces can be welded. Disadvantages, it a risky process. 
so high carefulness is needed high brittle metals cannot be welded it is not suitable for welding metals of low melting point question number eight what is solid state welding give its types answer solid state welding is the process of joining metals in solid state without melting them the types of solid state welding are friction welding ultrasonic welding diffusion welding explosive welding Question number 9 What is electro slag welding Give its applications Answer Electro slag welding is a process of joining two thick metal plates by the heat generated when electric current is passed through molten slag boiler plate turbine shaft stainless steel and carbon steel can Question number 10 What is resistance welding List out the types of resistance welding Answer In resistance welding the metal is heated to plastic stage due to the heat generated by the electric resistance. The types of resistance welding are, butt welding, spot welding, seam welding, projection welding. Hello friends. Welcome to Tech Mecha YouTube channels. This is our series welding video tutorial. In this video we discussed about welding interview question which is asked in top company interview. Hope a welding learner can gain knowledge after seeing these video tutorials. Let's start the video. Question number 1. What is spot welding? Answer. Spot welding. Spot welding is most often used to connect metal parts that are usually around 3 mm thick. The material to be welded is put between two copper electrodes. Electric current flows through the material to weld the two metals while pressure on them is maintained. Question number 2. What is seam welding? Answer. Seam welding. Seam welding is more complicated than spot welding. Two copper wheels replace the electrodes present in spot welding. The wheels create seams along two pieces of metal that bind them together. Seam welding is used to make items such as fuel tanks. Question number 3. What are the types of common joints? Answer. The main types of common joints are butt joints, T joints. Lap joints, open corner joints, closed corner joints. Question number 4. What is WPS? Answer. WPS is welding procedure specification. It is a written document that provides direction to the welder or welding operator for making production weld. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. What is the welding process? Answer. The common welding process is. Tav. Gas tungsten arc welding. B. Smav. Shielded metal arc welding. C. Saw. Submerged arc welding. D. Fko. Flux coated arc welding, E. Gmav, gas metal arc welding, F. Po, plasma arc welding. Question number 6. What are the different types of groove? Answer. Different types of groove are V, groove U, groove double V groove. Question number 7. What is the type of common welds? Answer. The common welds are groove welds, fillet welds, spot, seam welds, plug. Slot welds, edge welds. Question number 8. What are the welding imperfections? Answer. The main welding imperfections are 
Crags gas pores and cavities sold inclusions lack of fusion surface and profile mechanical surface damage misalignment Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification Question number 9 List out the applications of ultrasonic welding Answer The applications of ultrasonic welding it is used for welding metals up to 3 mm thick thin sheets can be joined with thick sheets electrical and electronic components can be welded plastic components can also be joined it is used for welding in nuclear reactor and aircraft parts Question number 10 What are the techniques used in diffusion welding Answer The techniques used in diffusion welding is hot pressure technique gas pressure technique vacuum furnace technique Question number 11 What are the advantages of atomic hydrogen welding Answer The advantages of atomic hydrogen welding are high quality weld joint can be obtained smooth and uniform weld is formed very high heat is produced the life of tungsten electrode is more also like comment and share the video Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Join our Facebook page and Facebook group. Also join our YouTube channel. Link this is our welding series box. video tutorial for beginner learner. In this video tutorial we discussed about basic welding interview question and answer 2021 which is very helpful to mechanical engineer for facing different viva and interview. From this video a mechanical engineer learn about basic welding viva question and answer that tasked in top company viva. After see this video a mechanical engineer gain knowledge about welding. Hope this video enjoyable to all. Question number 1. What is neutral flame? Give its application. Answer. The neutral flame is produced when equal quantities of oxygen and acetylene gases are used. Neutral flame is used for welding steel, cast iron, aluminum, copper and stainless steel. Question number 2. When carburizing flame is produced? State its applications. Answer. Carburizing flame is produced when the quantity of acetylene is more than oxygen. Carburizing flame is used for welding steel, alloy steels, non-ferrous metals, nickel and monoil metal. Question number 3. How oxidizing flame is produced? List out its applications. Answer: Oxidizing flame is produced when the quantity of oxygen is more than acetylene. Oxidizing flame is used for welding brass, bronze, manganese and steel. Question number 4. What is hard facing? List out its applications. Answer: Hard facing is a process of coating a hard metal powder on the surface of soft metals. Application: It is used for coating tungsten carbide and chromium carbide on the surface of cutting tool. It is used in reconditioning of worn out machine parts by coating required metal on it. It is used for coating hard metal in the die surface. Question number 5 What is laser List out the advantages of laser beam welding Answer Laser means light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation It is a beam of light having a single wavelength Advantages 
The temperature can be controlled easily welding can be accurately done no distortion occurs heat treated components can be welded without affecting its properties the weld is not affected by oxidation. Question number 6. What are types of brazing? Answer. The various types of brazing are torch brazing, dip brazing, induction brazing, furnace. Question number 7. What are the advantages and disadvantages of explosive welding? Answer. The advantages and disadvantages of explosive welding are advantages. It is a simple and fast process. The welding strength is high. Large surfaces can be welded. Disadvantages. It a risky process. So high carefulness is needed. High brittle metals cannot be welded. It is not suitable for welding metals of low melting point. Question number 8. What is solid state welding? Give its types. Answer. Solid state welding is the process of joining metals in solid state without melting them. The types of solid state welding are friction welding, ultrasonic welding, diffusion welding, explosive welding. Question number 9. What is electro slag welding? Give its applications. Answer. Electro slag welding is a process of joining two thick metal plates by the heat generated when electric current is passed through molten slag, boiler plate, turbine shaft, stainless steel and carbon steel can Question number 10. What is resistance welding? List out the types of resistance welding. Answer. In resistance welding, the metal is heated to plastic stage due to the heat generated by the electric resistance. The types of resistance welding are butt welding, spot welding, seam welding, projection welding. Join our Facebook page and Facebook group. Also join our YouTube channel. Hello friends, below welcome box. to Tech Mecha YouTube channels. This is our series welding video tutorial. In this video we discussed about welding interview question which is asked in top company interview. Hope a welding learner can gain knowledge after seeing these video tutorials. Let's start the video. Question number 1. What is spot welding? Answer. Spot welding. Spot welding is most often used to connect metal parts that are usually around 3 mm thick. The material to be welded is put between two copper electrodes. Electric current flows through the material to weld the two metals while pressure on them is maintained. Question number 2. What is seam welding? Answer. Seam welding. Seam welding is more complicated than spot welding. Two copper wheels replace the electrodes present in spot welding. The wheels create seams along two pieces of metal that bind them together. Seam welding is used to make items such as fuel tanks. Question number 3. What are the types of common joints? Answer. The main types of common joints are butt joints, T joints. Lap joints, open corner joints, closed corner joints. Question number 4. What is WPS? Answer. WPS is welding procedure specification. It is a written document that provides direction to the welder or welding operator for making production weld. Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification. Also like, comment and share the video. Question number 5. What is the welding process? Answer. The common welding process is. Tav. Gas tungsten arc welding. B. Smav. Shielded metal arc welding. C. Saw. 
submerged arc welding d fco flux coated arc welding e gmav gas metal arc welding f po plasma arc welding question number 6 what are the different types of groove answer different types of groove are v groove u groove double v groove question number 7 what is the type of common welds answer the common welds are groove welds fillet welds spot seam welds plug slot welds edge welds question number 8 what are the welding imperfections answer the main welding imperfections are cracks gas pores and cavities sold inclusions lack of fusion surface and profile mechanical surface damage misalignment please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification Question number 9 List out the applications of ultrasonic welding Answer The applications of ultrasonic welding it is used for welding metals up to 3 mm thick thin sheets can be joined with thick sheets electrical and electronic components can be welded plastic components can also be joined it is used for welding in nuclear reactor and aircraft parts Question number 10 What are the techniques used in diffusion welding Answer The techniques used in diffusion welding is hot pressure technique gas pressure technique vacuum furnace technique Question number 11 What are the advantages of atomic hydrogen welding Answer The advantages of atomic hydrogen welding are high quality weld joint can be obtained smooth and uniform weld is formed very high heat is produced the life of tungsten electrode is more also like comment and share the video Please press the subscribe button and click the bell for update notification.